hey uh what's up guys i hope you're all doing good uh good morning good afternoon good evening from wherever you're watching this video from my name is nasto welcome and uh welcome back to today's uh video guys thank you so much for clicking if you haven't subscribed kindly hit the subscribe button also feel free to give the video a like and also you can comment what you really think about uh today's video guys so today is a super special day i just came here to uh, survey walk around and see how everything goes by so in front of me this is uh villa medellin or i am marwa's villa one of the homes that has really inspired a lot of people has really changed uh, so many lives and most of us look up to him and uh, we are so grateful for him on introducing us on this youtube platform and also to you guys that have been very very supportive since day one that most of us just uh, appeared on on the internet or on uh, social media thank you so much guys for really supporting us today guys i really think this is a very nice spot of uh, uh, taking shower yeah eh, 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 eh. i think people have really been uh, so creative on this river they have really made uh, something here that can now i'm just trying to find a place where we can uh, go down you see people really became creative and created here a bathing or rather a bathing spot like this you see so in front here eh, 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 eh. <laughs> It has become something like uh, a swimming pool. This one, this one here. It's very lively. I don't know guys if you can see the water. Let me just go in. Yeah, wow, wow, wow. The water is very clear, you see? It... Yeah, anyway guys, today I just came here to start my video and also to see how this river, uh, how this river is really faring. It's very clean these days, very, very clean, you see? The water is very clean because uh, activities such as uh, maybe sand harvesting have really gone down because also the the rain has stopped so most of the sand harvesting these days does not happen here too much and you can see how the water is really clear very clear but this river here is very helpful especially to the community to us the people around here some come to wash their clothes some bring uh, cattle like you can see there some cattle are just grazing by the riverside and also when they feel thirsty they just uh, drink the water so anyway guys I just came here also to maybe wash my legs and start the day off you know when you have a cold shower in the morning <laughs> it always really feels good so let's just wow. the water is really cold let me I don't know why I can't put the camera I want to place it somewhere here I don't know if here it will go with the water ah, I'm just trying to find a good spot a nice spot so that we can do the uh, yeah there let me do the small showering whoosh I feel like taking a shower here in the river. <laughs> so that's how you wash your your legs, just on a stone like this. You can use even uh, soil. Yeah, at least now I feel uh, somehow fresh. I 
at least now I feel somehow really fresh. Yeah, so guys, in today's video, we have somewhere where we are, or rather where I'm building uh, our home. And I've been really looking for doors uh, for the bedrooms. So today, guys, we want to go somewhere and check whether we can e easily find the bedroom doors. We'll be heading to the border town. It's called Sirare. So that we can go and select or do some uh, window shopping for the doors. In case if we find maybe a good door, we'll have to buy them. My friend, Vip, Nachunga. Nachunga. Uh -huh. Barry the What's your name? My name is James Ngarasi. James Ngarasi. Yeah. Okay, my friend. So now, I'm going to You're crazy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay. Thank you so much, James. You. Yeah, so. These are our neighbors here in the village. It's just taking care of the animals. It's a morning routine to most people here in the village, like grazing cows. You know, when you bring them from... Uh, let me tell you how, <laughs> how the morning routine works here in the village. For example, if you have animals. You know, right now, most people are planting. So some are also doing the plowing with the cow so when you wake up the cows around 4 3 a.m 4 a.m you take them to the farms they do the tilling after that you have to come and graze the cows for like maybe two three hours when it gets midday when the sun is very hot you now tie them somewhere until maybe 4 p.m again you open for them you graze them like that so this is our small bridge here I don't know if this bridge is still strong yeah I just hope it's still strong yeah it's very strong so this is uh, the kind of bridge that we just use to access this upper area from this side but I know and I have hopes that maybe one day in, uh, in future the, the government can just come to this place and uh, at least even build a small bridge yeah you know because most of our moms uh, Sorry, someone is calling me. Hello? It's a reverse call. Hello? Boa? Mko salam? Hey? Eh? Oh, what's an epigio jama bas ni mwambi? Hey? Oh, my mother is a kupalilia. So, na kupigia tu kidogo tu. Yeah, actually guys, that is uh, also another good update. We you know the place there where we were planting maize so that during the harvesting season we can take the maize to the uh to the charity home or rather the orphanage home. So they have just told me that we were trying to make holes around that compound so that we can uh, fence for the person who bought that land. So they have already done with uh, making the holes. And also, good news, the maize has already come out. So yesterday we started by, uh, by weeding the maize. Today they have already finished. So it's very good news, very good news. And uh, you know also you are very lucky to plant in time. Most people uh, have not started planting. But some, those that started early, the maize is this size. Yeah, the maize is already this size and we have started uh, plant or rather weeding the maize. So I'm very happy and uh, also I'm sure that maybe in the next three months, the children will have at least something to put on, on uh, their stomachs. Yeah, and they'll be very happy. So thank you so much Gladys for just thinking about the young kids. The maize are really doing good. Probably before this video ends, we will uh, rush there. Just go and see how they have done the weeding and also how they have done the... Uh, yeah, you know, when fencing somewhere, you have to start first by uh, making the holes. You have to make the holes and then we buy the posts, the cedar posts, put them with our concrete. Yesterday we took their ballast and sand also. So it's a good progress. Yeah, the work is uh, going on very well wow just look at how beautiful the village it has already started now becoming green i think this maze also is for mayugno yeah you know most people now we are also turning into agriculture apart from also vlogging we're also trying to just have different channels of uh 
maybe income where you can plant maize like this yeah so that in future you don't have maybe to ask for food or something you see we are very good farmers in our village here so this is how we plant you see just in one line you skip some maybe one feet you plant another one and also you know as time goes by the agricultural officers came up with a, a better way a better way of uh, planting so just one 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 maize per hole you know previously we used to put two two maize seeds in one hole but then they told us hey i think when you put one like this and uh, close and leave a space here you you end up harvesting more yields compared to maybe the time that we used to plant two per hole you know sometimes when you plant two uh the maize end up one becomes big another one tiny so you end up uh, using a lot of seeds and uh, you get low yield compared to this uh, modern style of planting wow. I, I really uh, i really like how these farmers are uh, very very courageous in also planting large scale you see just look at how beautiful this uh, shamba is it's very very amazing guys very amazing so we're heading to our home there I go show you our house that I'm also going to try and find uh, the doors selecting a door actually has been very hard even in one point I thought maybe of even putting metal doors <laughs> but that that house is very beautiful we can't put maybe metal doors inside or guys you can tell me on the comment section have you ever seen maybe a house just a modern house and that has maybe some metal doors inside but for me, I just want to go to the border town, maybe see if we can find just good doors, strong doors. We only need uh, two doors because there are two bedrooms. So we'll head maybe somewhere where there's a carpenter place, check the different varieties of doors that they have and see whether we, we might get lucky. Yeah, and also guys, uh, I really want now to start the process of, uh, if you're an architecture, or you're good in uh, maybe drawing uh, modern houses you know <laughs> this is a dream that i've always dreamt of but i was really scared of uh, facing my fears you know what? because i believe we all have our like uh, our dream houses most of us have our dream houses so i just started by going small yeah the house that i've built is a two bedroom but then I don't know if it's a dream something just came inside me and told me hey Nast, you can even start uh, collecting material one by one actually today i've bought like uh we have two trips of sand there and also within the day maybe we might have uh so this is my ignorance place they actually they've already started uh construction of the upper place i'm very happy for him this is his dream house that he's just built. I don't know if he's here. Yeah, or he has uh, maybe left. But let's go and check on the progress of the house. I'm so happy for him, so happy for him, guys. Yeah, this is every person's dream to at least have a beautiful home. So this here is my Magris house. We have Mbosi and Boka just relaxing by the door side. Yeah. So this is a uh, Rindima Villa. This is Rindima Villa. Very beautiful house. Very, very beautiful house. Very admirable. Very beautiful. So let's go through in here. I don't know if it's around. Wow, construction is not easy. Just look at how many trees you have to buy just to support your house. Yeah. Nyad? Oh boy. Imagine the materials you use. Wow. <laughs> Scary. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Mr. Kudu. Yeah. Yeah. Fondi. I'm not going. Vip. Koboa. I'm not saying TV too. Uh huh. I know. I'm not going to Yeah. They already started by setting up the house. And we have Mr. Kudu here. He lost from YouTube. <laughs> Will he quit? Yes, did you quit YouTube? Will you watch? Yeah, I'm going to video. 
niweke video kwa vile simu yangu ilipoteka. Oh, ilipoteza simu. Yeah. yeah, guys, I don't know if you remember Kudu during the time of building uh, the first house. This was the guy who built that house and today I think he has come to look for Mayugno. Yeah, today I'm I'm going I'm going I'm coming home. Yes, you're you're coming back home. Yeah, you're coming up <laughs> back home. Yes. Uh, Mr. Kudu. Mr. Kudu. Hello guys, me is uh, I am Kudu. Yeah. Such I am Kudu after yeah, Mr. Kudu says when he buys a phone, he'll be back on uh, YouTube. So, guys, this is uh, Mayugno's place, Rendima Villa. Mayugno, are you poor? Oh, Nakuja? Okay, okay. Yeah, so he has already started now the construction of this uh, dream house. So, this is a very beautiful house, very beautiful. So, Ayaban, Tamini Pan. So he's not around. I thought maybe I'll find him here, but he's uh he's not around. So this is uh his dream house. Yeah, what's your dream house, guys? Maybe you can comment down below. What is uh the definition of maybe a dream house? I think for me it's that house that you will now live forever, even if your family expands, even if you have uh, maybe your mom, your relatives coming to visit you. I think they can now easily fit into the house that you built. So, uh, <laughs> when I wanted to start construction, uh, so many of you guys told me, hey Nasto, go big, go big. But trust me, I had so much fear inside me. And I thought that, hey, I might start this uh, project here and then maybe get stuck on the way. So I was really scared. But I'm very happy that most of you have really stood with me and uh, we have finished that house within maybe like uh, five, six months. Yeah, six months. So very soon we are moving in and then now officially I'll start collecting materials now for the, for the dream house, slowly by slowly. I still don't even have that picture of maybe how the house will be. But I believe one day, one time. You know, that's why even today I've just started by collecting materials for that house i've bought two tippers of sand uh also the uh, two two tips of uh stones are on the way so i'll just recollect myself slowly by slowly gathering uh materials slowly by slowly even if it takes me maybe a year of just gathering materials not something like uh stones can never go bad so i'll just start just look at how this maze is beautiful wow these were the first among the very first people to just risk and start uh, planting early. So the maize are really doing good. And I'm really happy that we'll not be having any more hunger in the village. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Anna Yataga? Yeah. Hey. So, so. Uh, ah, yeah. Yeah, they are sending me so that they can be brought lunch by probably Mama Ann, but she was not feeling well. I've met her like two days ago. She was not feeling that well. So I hope maybe by today she's feeling much better. Yeah, so as I was saying, and also that's why I really wanted also to maybe make a, make a wall around and then, uh, uh, yeah, make a wall. Even if now you start your construction, you're living in your own compound, it becomes really easy to manage things and uh, be there physically. Gather your materials slowly by slowly. That's why I was really rushing into maybe trying to complete the wall so that even if now I start bring the materials slowly by slowly, even if it's still, there is no worries, yeah? And also I'll be living in uh, my home here, or rather our compound. And then gathering now the materials one after the other, one after the other, slow by slow. Yeah, so kindly guys, keep subscribing to my channel, keep liking the videos. I'm seeing, uh, I don't know if that is Marwa or who. So let me go and say hi to them. Yeah, so guys, uh, we are here now. So this is what I was talking about. I've actually started uh, working on my dream house. This is uh, just one step. I believe uh, one day 
I will have a very beautiful structure standing here. So this is just the beginning. Keep praying for me, guys. Keep wishing me well. Yeah, your support is uh, what I really need. By watching my videos, liking the videos, and this is like a thank you that I can give to you guys, so that one day we can have a beautiful home here. If any one of you visits, you can uh, at least say, "Hey, Nasto, do you have a place for me here?" So. We are pouring the stones here. So this was the first steeper they brought. This one. So now they are pouring another one. Nyaj. Salam. Yeah. Hey, Nata Mujazi Maweva. Thank you. Eh? Thank you. This is Chacha here. I think you know me. Please, can you assist me to get a job? To get a job? Oh, a job, yeah. Yeah. You see the vehicle, you marry me. Hi. 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 Uh, this is Chacha, and even I, I saw you even has a YouTube channel. Yeah, Munyamwin, yeah. Munyamwin. Please, can you subscribe for me? Yeah, Munyamwin, he has a YouTube channel, guys. Kindly, let's go support him, subscribe to his channel. Let's get him to a thousand subscribers. He's the one who supplies the whole area here with building materials like uh, sand. When you let the sand, yeah, this is very good sand that he brought. We so did the work but not yeah, on a corner. He brought, uh, he brought two trips of sand, this one and this one. So if someone wants you to supply for them, maybe your phone number? Uh, plus 254. Yes. 724 yes. 65 4199. And we repeat again. Plus 254. 724 65 yes. 41 99. Yeah, Take another day, you give me a customer in Migori. You took. Yeah, so you told me you should call me, but okay, call me. okay. Maybe they will call you guys yeah. if you need uh, any material, sand, yeah. stones. This is the right guy to just call. And when he tells you that I'm on the way, trust me, he's always on the way. So even in the morning, he told me, Hey, Nasto, I'm bringing for you the stones. And uh, here they are. Even yesterday, he brought these ones. I've not yet paid him. But yeah, he's a very trustworthy person. So Asante Sana Chacha. Yeah, so guys, this one here now we have already started gathering materials for uh, our dream home. That one day, one day, I'm very certain that we will start something here very uh, constructive. The truck just left. Guys, I'm so much excited, so much excited. Thank you for everyone for at least uh, making me want to even dream much bigger guys much much bigger so i'll just be gathering materials material after material stone after stone slowly by slowly i'll just put a pile of stones here a pile of uh, sand maybe make also a few blocks so that uh, also the sand that is here this one is very good also for maybe making uh, blocks so i'll also start by making blocks just like we did to this house we we'll start by making uh, block after block maybe arranging them in uh, one corner until we have enough blocks and maybe maybe within this year we can officially start a project i don't know maybe the timeline but for me i've just decided that i will just be collecting uh, stone after stone sand after sand especially during this uh, rainy season you know the rains are almost here so this is the perfect time just to start by buying sand so help me god so that we can uh, achieve this dream so the blocks that we made these are the ones that uh, remain but hey construction is not easy construction is not easy i first want to go for uh, a small break before i build uh, this upper wall here so that i can take a small break maybe gather some materials also because also this uh, wall here needs uh, some stones so i'll just gather, be gathering 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 when we have also enough we can use some for making this wall some for uh, our dream house yeah i don't know if i'm dreaming too big but i'm just challenging myself with uh, the little uh, things that i'll be getting just investing in materials investing in materials so that one day because this place here that's the main reason why even i set the house just as the corner there and also when we officially move in it can be easy just to monitor things as they unfold slowly by slowly so also uh the other day 
we started here a project uh, we are trying to remove or rather to flatten this area here yeah you see when the ballast that we bought right now it's being used so there's nothing that goes uh, on west here so mr yeyo has Yeyo. come back yeyo 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 na kwa wale wote msio nijua yeah. mimi ni kijana wa nasto yes. wakati mwingine nipo kwa blaza mayugu na wakati mwingine kwa blaza maro ya yeah. nashukuru kwa support mnazo zitoa kwa blaza zangu maro kwa blaza zangu mayugu no kwa blaza zangu nasto misifule masti empire yes yes kevo zilo zilo wani zilo zilo wani mabere musa mabere musa yes sipriani Yaani ni wengi wakina yeah. maji. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alafu pia ni wengi. Yeah. Siwezi taja wote nikamaliza kweli. Maana wengine unaweza kujifikiria ni hao tu ndio wanaojua. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lakini mimi nawakubali wote na pia natoa pongezi zangu kwa wale watu mnaoen support yeye kama yeye. I'm happy. Na shukuru kabisa mimi ni mzima wa afya na kwa wale ambao mjisikii vizuri nitawaombea kwa Mungu na yeye mwenyewe aweze kuatia unafu angalau basi tuwe wote wazima kama mimi yes ni fly sana kwa salimia yeah, so yes and misa, nime fly sana kwa salimia ni kazi na na yeah. pamba na pamba he is really doing a, a nice job yeah. yeah. hey, ume, umetengeneza vizuri sana he is really doing hey, jana uh, nilikuepo au uh, jana ulikuja jioni eh hey, a uh, a uh. huh. niliwai ha uh. jana hata chai nilikunywa uh, yesterday did not come to this place but he says yesterday he came to work Yesterday tu mvua sehemu ilikuwa imekuwa ngumu. Ah ya yeah, ya. Yeah, Afadhali yeah. hata jana nashukuru Mungu ameweza kukumbuka kidogo mvua imenyesha <laughs> angalau ndio maana unaona udongo angalau pa melaini kalaini. Yeah, he says at least yesterday you know it rained so the ground is somehow uh, soft. But Yeyo has really said thank you so much to everyone who supports us and everyone who supports Yeyo kama Yeyo. So maybe for the people who don't know who Yeyo is, Yeyo is uh, our gardener here. He really does an amazing job. Uh, so he was away for a few days but he tells me the body was not feeling uh, was feeling somehow weak but he's again back to work so and uh, yeah slowly by slowly we are going to remove mdogo mdogo slowly slowly wanasemaje yes kazi ni moyo kazi ni moyo unajua unapokuwa na moyo kwa kufanya kazi sawa mara nyingi kazi na kwa gani nzuri yeah mimi nina moyo hata angalau nijitahidi leo hata ikiwezekana kesho nije nimalize kwa sababu nina moyo nimalize hii kazi niingie kwenye kazi nyingine yes e, kwa sababu kila siku nikisema ni hapa kazi zingine zitalala kweli kwa hiyo cha msingi lazima tu nijipe moyo afu lazima ni, nifanye kazi kwa bidii ili angalau kesho Mungu akisaidia nije nimalize kazi nije niendelee na kazi zingine asante yeah, yeah, says he wants to work extra hard so that maybe by tomorrow or the day after tomorrow at least this place now will be completed i'm just trying to find uh, a good view for this house so that it can be haina <laughs> shit yes oh blaza tansame yeah 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 ila kesho na kesho kutwa naweza nikatokea endapo nikimaliza kazi hiyo utaniwe alazi utanisamea tu sana no problem yeah so you know also he had promised that maybe by monday yesterday we will have finished this work and maybe go to my ignos place but things uh, got mixed up at the middle but i know by tomorrow he'll be done and he will be at my ignos place also to assist so the stones or rather the sand that he's removing this place we are also trying to uh, move it to this place so that at least it can be maybe somehow leveled this place here we are just uh, throwing all all the soil here so that at least we can levelize this place and maybe plant also some uh, some grass so it's not an easy job yeah so let me help you with uh, at least one wheelbarrow kama itakaa wapi like that ah ndalago mkoa soft 
Mwili nyesha nyingi? Mwili nyesha nyesha nyingi ndio maana hata nimeona mm. kwenye kumwagilia hata nitamwagilia baadaye maana. Wapi? Oh. Eh, sasa we kama udongo wenyewe umekuwa hivi. Mm. Na hiyo mafuta sinajua ilikuwa ni line line. Mm. Sasa hivi hata kuna zingine zimetoka. Eh zimekemaza. Mm. Sasa tuzinunue. Sasa na mpango. Mm. Najua pale hivi natakiwa nije nikate nani vile vijiti hivi. Mm kwa ajili ya kutia hivi afu kwa ajili ya kuna nina maana hiyo maandalizi mmm naweza nikaanza hapa lakini sijui lakini ngoja tu tajitahidi mimi wote wale mbaraka yeye natakiwa nije niende na panga nikija niwe napita huko njiani mmm na kikata vijiti eh oh hizi nini kubwa yeah, so let's go with uh, this one. Hey. Fazali me sa idea ki dobi. Kazi ni moyo. Kazi ni moyo. Na jua bila moyo, wazi fanya kazi mzuri. Na ilu fanya kazi mzuri, kazi mo we na moyo, o kufanya kazi. Mara nyingi wengi wanafeli kazi kwa sababu ya kitu kimoja. Maana mm -hmm. unakuta mtu hata apendi ile kazi anafanya tu ili mradi. <laughs> ah. Yeah, he's a funny man. Yeah, you saying <coughs> sometimes you find maybe someone doesn't like maybe doing uh, work because maybe they don't enjoy. So we are just testing to see how this work is. Yes, 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 Yeah, so we are working on uh, our bohol. There is a uh, very high chance that very soon, guys, we are going to get uh, water. And I see also Mr. Mokami here is helping out. Mokami, yes, Mr. Mokami. how are you? Mzima kabisa. Eh tunashukuru Mungu tumeamka salamu. Yes. Eh tunawasaidia wazee kwa sababu unaonesha jisimachete. 
tumepata na changamoto yeah 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 so tunaona kama tunaweza tukalipoti sisi tukapata maji yeah 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 natamani sana tupate maji for sure kuliko mbele ya kudra za mall yeah tutapata inshallah kutapata yeah we are trying to cover the borehole uh, there is a small rock that has been found inside the borehole again but at least you know with this one that's why even I'm just uh continuing to invest in it because most of the boreholes we went like uh 20 feet 20 feet uh maybe 10 to 15 the other boreholes all of them were 20 to uh, 10 to 15 feet and then you find a very big uh, stone but at least for this one we have gone like uh 20 feet or even more so that's why i just decided that let me just try to invest in it we, we blast it even uh, if it's once yeah just i'm so like i have that desire of just having water flowing in this compound i tried asking for the guys who drill uh with the with the uh with the big machine but they said it was very expensive and uh honestly i cannot afford maybe just bring a whole uh truck here to drill water and it's the best solution but also it's very expensive they were saying like uh five 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 thousand dollars imagine five thousand dollars so that is money that i cannot have just to fetch water here but i know by the god's grace at least we are going to find water here in case now we we don't find the water i'll now maybe give up on uh, finding a water solution in this uh, in this place but i've really tried guys i've really tried let me show you the number of boreholes maybe you know someone is saying hey nastu is lying he has never maybe uh tried looking for water but we had yeah we had one here we had one borehole here this one was a borehole but now we changed it into a septic for the toilet or for the kitchen we also have another one here yeah, there's a hole here that is the hole also this one we we missed finding what and lastly there is a, a third one here let me show you this one now we are using it as a, a rubbish pit so there's also this one here but soon it will be covered yeah this is the last one you see this one so i've tried three boreholes imagine three boreholes just trying to find water and i've never found anything so i was about to give up but again i found just some small strength and said let me just continue one more time and uh, that one has really gone deep 20 feet you know most people find water around uh, 20 feet so we just have that high hope that at least with this one if we just blow it maybe once uh, or twice we might be able to find water and we'll be here guys with you to celebrate so let's head to the border town just go and try if we can find also uh, door frames let me show you what what we are going to look for because the other day we slept in this house <laughs> but there was no there were no doors so it was somehow tricky yeah it was somehow tricky yeah and also maybe very soon we will be traveling uh to nairobi uh, maybe with miss flair we go there maybe and look for maybe uh, window curtains and uh, maybe door curtains yeah just keep us in your prayers i have so many things that i really need to fix it's only that uh, <laughs> uh things are not going well as planned so there is a door frame here that i'm going to look uh for at the border town maybe try and see if we can find maybe good frames and also a strong door for the bedroom and uh, there's also this one for the guest bedroom so these two bedrooms don't have doors so let's head to the border town maybe go and try if we can find uh, perfect doors for our house here
it to you now I wanna wake up with you in the morning Say what you wanna say to me now I wanna wake up with you in the morning Some of this never fake to me now I wanna wake up with you in the morning But we can, we can do nothing, do nothing at all So what, so what If you're stupid then you know it's nothing wrong Yeah, so guys, I'm here at the timber yard where they make uh, custom doors from indigenous trees and I think this place here I've really been looking for a, a very nice place to find just yes, strong trees made out of uh, or rather strong doors made out of indigenous trees and uh, so these are the kind of doors that I've really been looking for and I think I'll make one that has flowers like this for the bedroom so this one is very hard it's pure timber you know these days especially if you go to hardwares the kind of doors that you find mostly inside even if you just give it one blow you just pass your hand through the door but these ones these are, are very strong doors these are very strong doors and uh, i believe uh, these guys will work with them so they use this kind of uh, trees these ones are very indigenous very indigenous trees and also very strong and uh, they cannot easily be maybe eaten by termites so i really like this place so we have we have this type there is a, a type that has flowers like this there's also another one that has uh, designs like uh, this one and uh, there is uh, now the last one i think for me i'll go with uh, a design like this one i think this one is a strong door that we can just uh, put in our house so i'm so happy just uh, to be brought here by mokami and uh, yeah even my heart is now happy so the machines are like this it's a big yard it's a very big yard they make uh cupboards here mokami yeah mokami here says yeah let's see the design of the door yeah yeah this one is this is how they make just handmade <laughs> yeah this is the, yeah. Yeah, this is uh, the kind of uh, door that you are going to buy so we are going with uh, the carpenter to our place so that they can also measure the frames so that they can know bibi baba kwa salam nimekuja huko niwachangie milango nilikuwa nikitafuta milango mizuri migumu alafu nafanya video yangu pia kuna watu wenye ongetamani labda milango kama yeye na waletea ma customer hapa pia yeah so i'm just trying to explain to him so this one i don't i think this one is also a cupboard maybe they're making yeah so we'll be heading home with uh, one of the guys here so that they can go and uh, maybe measure the required uh, measurements we came with our measurements but they said they have to go and confirm be be before maybe placing a door you have to make uh, door frames so they want to make door frames at least that has something like a vent on top maybe you can put a glass on top and now the door can uh, come from uh, below yeah so but they are very expensive this one is like uh, it's like they have said it's uh, 12,000 Kenya shilling but I think it's a fair price because I've gone to maybe big hardwares <coughs> and uh, they sell for even a door of 20,000 shillings but it's not a strong door so for this one I've re I'm uh, really happy just coming here to find this door but the price of the door is different the price of the frame is different so it's like uh, 15,000 maybe in total that is like maybe a hundred dollars just imagine finding a good door at a fair price so I'm just happy so we'll be heading with them back so that we can go now and uh, do maybe the measurements yeah they even make uh, beds this so these are the legs for the beds but the timbers are very very strong the tree we call it omobo <laughs> that is uh, in Korean language so let's head with them back at home make the measurements and then uh, work to begin officially guys so I'm just happy to find a place like this so they even make uh, this kind of beds very big beds like these ones yeah but for me what we came to buy here is just the doors and unfortunately you can't you can't just walk in a place like this and find maybe a desirable door you have to you have to make them on order so you pay an advance they make for you the door with your required measurements and then you just go and fit your door so uh, 
for me that is the best design that i've just uh found so very soon maybe in a week's time we are officially going now to fix uh doors in our house so i'm very much excited guys very much excited yeah so again guys now officially now we have already started uh making our gate so this is the progress very soon we are now going to install the gate hey this one is very good yeah yeah the gate looks uh very lively so these ones the the reels the reels for us now we'll want them to just flow on this other end yeah hey yeah yeah officially now guys this is how the gate will be i know very soon they'll start now fixing some other things mulangu kwa mulangu Ni Oh, it's a cat. So here's where the door will be. Where, for example, if you don't want to open maybe the whole gate, I think, oh yeah, places in upper. Yeah, they'll be cutting these ones. Uh, so that now, yeah, for me, I'm very happy. Thank you so much, sir. Yes. I can see the work is going on yes. well. Yeah. They're going on yeah. with the work. Yeah, I knew you will deliver very a good soon. job. Yes. After three days. You come and collect your gift. After three days? Yes. Okay, no problem, sir. Right. Thank you so much for delivering. Yeah, so guys, let's head to the place. We were just passing by, and I remembered that we have a gate here that we need to fix. Why do you buy a kujaba then? Yeah, he says we should uh, throw in some deposit. Yeah, I know. I think we'll just paint it. Maybe this color or any desired paint that we'll see fitting. Yeah, now we are uh, already home. Uh, the the carpenter, I don't know if I should call him the carpenter now. He's just now taking the measurements for the doors so that now officially, guys, we can start uh, making. I think I made a really big mistake. I wish I knew earlier I would have even placed maybe the door frames before maybe plastering the house. Yeah, but everything happens for a reason and I know yeah, we'll just make it up because we'll need maybe to make some small holes on top there in the middle here and also down here so that the, the frame so that yeah so that the frame of the door can uh, go inside and become a very strong frame I think I was very much confused because I didn't need to know which kind of a door to make i've never built before so i was very much excited and i didn't know maybe which step to start with where to end but me i'm happy guys that uh, you guys have really holded my hand yeah and we are here watching my videos every day that is the biggest thing the biggest support you can ever give to any youtuber just watch their videos comment uh, like their videos and also share with family and friends so that all of you can uh, subscribe to our channels and help us grow and uh, help us also achieve uh, the dreams of uh, our dreams as we share to you our stories and also stories about Africa and uh, the entire world so they have already finished uh, blowing the borehole yeah so we are now waiting for it to be cleaned they clean it and then we see you can see there were some small rocks that were being found inside yeah, like these ones have somehow hard they couldn't manage to yeah they couldn't manage maybe to just use uh, uh the the drilling machine but i really wish also this kind of a guy had my had maybe the gadgets for drilling especially maybe inside boreholes like this there's a hand machine that can be just used to drill maybe the stones wherever you find them in a borehole instead of maybe knocking uh, with your bare hands but yeah everything happens for a reason guys but at least this borehole i just have high hopes that we are uh, we will be finding what and also guys another thing our wall now uh, the behind wall here is uh completed i think it's uh building it is completed now we have begun another job of just putting the uh using these timbers the only problem we usually face uh, with timbers is they cut them in uh, making shapes like this. You see like this one was a full timber but it was cut. So you end up again being told, hey, bring other timbers. So it's a very hectic problem, maybe constructed, but I'm not complaining. So we have started now laying the timbers like this. 
so that now we can use the uh, ballast fill them here and uh, have our home so i'll need maybe to add uh, more bags of cement probably maybe 20. see here we are now remaining with only two <laughs> yeah so from tomorrow i uh, will need to bring uh, more bags of cement continue now with uh, building the wall yes yeah so i was saying you see now we have started uh, laying the timbers these will be placed here this one will be placed here just like that we are using our timbers that uh, we have been buying from time to time so now officially after they finish maybe placing the timbers probably tomorrow we'll now start uh, putting in the ballast for uh, our wall here yeah guys it's uh evening time towards the end of the day uh, we have really been doing uh, great work here with the uh, year so now we want also to plant some some of the seeds that we bought or rather green vegetables that we bought uh, in our nursery here because at least now the sun has gone at, uh, somehow down so i have my cousin here mr derrick okay yes how are you mr derrick i'm fine yes yes yeah derrick is uh Mabere musa's younger brother yeah. so he came here to also assist me in uh, the nursery here okay. so that we can uh, plant some seedling and also i'm just trying also to encourage him on joining uh youtube yeah mr derrick are you are you ready to open up a youtube channel yeah i'm ready yes maybe yes, you can introduce yourself okay i'm derrick matiko yes the brother to maberia musa yeah. a youtuber a content creator yes okay kindly go and support my brother yeah support it's nasto maja and miss play yeah and you also want to become a youtuber yeah yeah what I do you want. like about youtube maybe YouTube, okay, I'm eagerly to join YouTube, but the the thing that if you're the fan is to join. Yeah. <laughs> <You mean. laughs> English is is not vegetarian. <laughs> English simply much it. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay, the when you need to yes, time. Okay, the adisim. Oh, you're phone. not allowed to use. Okay. We are allowed yes but the thing is there's there are restrictions yeah uh, so you know guys uh, mr derrick here is in uh, the national youth service so it's a place where you go to do maybe different trainings yeah they give you different trainings there so sometimes they have rest restrictions where you cannot use maybe your phone during uh, work time yeah but maybe when he gets free time he can be uploading maybe a video after the other so maybe the name you'll just use derrick matiko eh? Yeah, you can matiko junior, matiko junior. Yeah. or he will be using matiko junior so when he'll be ready to open up a channel he will let me know so that we can uh, really support him guys yeah so we want now to put some of the seeds that remained here with uh mr yeo here hey, come on. yeah hey. we have uh, saga spider plant mm. we also have uh mm. onions yeah yeah so let us work a your bus Lazima to mwagie maji. Asiweke kwanza. Yeah, you can. Uh, so let's start with the uh, the carrots. I've never even me I've never seen how <laughs> how carrots seeds look like. Yeah, so we'll just be Mwage nyingi kidogo. Mwage nyingi. Yeah, so we are just placing the carrot seeds here. Hopefully we Maybe very soon we can harvest some carrots. Buy in Indian dog. Actually, nakubali. Anataka yani toshe the whole. I want it to be enough for the whole nursery. Actually, na jua kambi guka moja. The carrot moja. Sandio na ni moja yu. Ah, I don't want to use a lot. It has very good smell. Hey, na nukia vizuri. Yeah. I'm just trying to. This is carrot here. Just. Do you want to make it? Make a cherry. Hmm. I think maybe we'll have bought uh, 50 grams. This one here is 25 grams. But hopefully it will be enough. Any bunny bunny to dog. Wow, 
we can't wait to harvest some uh, carrots from uh, our kitchen garden here. We share. Mm. Yeah, at least. Mm. Yeah. So this this one here is for the carrots that we have just planted. So we finish here. Have to take a match. Yeah. So we just need to cover it and then add uh, sprinkle some water on it. In order to measure funika na magia, to measure funika. So we'll also be using this one. So let's use some uh, some of these branches because grass grass is not available here. So we'll just cover using these uh, branches here to prevent moisture. It's not my side view. So when you become a YouTuber, you have to record from uh, where the sun is coming like this. You know, if you record like this, the sun prevents the image okay, right. yeah. so, just using this one this two. in place of uh, yeah. just trying to cover to prevent uh, moisture from evaporating Just like this, and then now we can do the watering. You know, I'm, I'm afraid. You know, we might if we had left it like this, without maybe covering, and then maybe at night it rains. And you know, most of these seeds they are very expensive. They're not they're not cheap. So it's much better if we just complete the work once and for all. Even if you go to sleep, you're just happy. Yeah, yeah. 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 Just like that. And then now we can do now the watering. So guys will be planting most of this just around this place. So that maybe very soon, maybe in a, a month's time, we can have plenty of uh, food. Just natural food, uh, homegrown from this place. So we're now doing the watering like that. In case maybe it doesn't rain, at least we'll have uh, gotten some uh, some water. Yeah, yeah. Even the yeah. This is the orange. You can see how green. Yeah. It's very green. Maybe very soon we are also have going to be having some fruits in this compound. I even saw our popo there, it has already started producing, we have a, a guava here. So we have variety, variety of fruits, variety of uh, green vegetables. Yeah, I'm still planning on using the poles that remained. Yes, I'm going to use the poles. Yes, I'm going to use the poles. Yes, I've forgotten one thing. He says that he really enjoys anytime just saying hi to you guys. Yeah, he feels so very good. Yeah, kijana na sto. Yeah. Wakati mwingine niko kwa blaza mayugu na wakati mwingine kwa blaza marwa. Yes. Nashukuru kitu kimoja. Tuonge kwenda huko. Eh nashukuru kwa kitu kimoja. Yes. Kwa watu mnao msupport blaza marwa, mnao msupport blaza mayugu no. Yes. 
Mnao msupport Blaza Nasto. Mnao msupport Maja, mnao msupport Misifule, mnao msupport Mars Empire, mnao msupport Cyprian. Ni wengi sana. Na siwezi maliza. Ila kiujumla tu mimi naweza sema nawapenda na pia kwa wale wote mnaonikumbuka mimi yeye kama yeye. Nasema nashukuru Mungu nimemaliza kazi salama. Ye sasa hivi nashukuru Brother Nasta amekuja sasa hivi ananisaidia saidia kazi yeah, hapo. Yeah, I'm assisting. Ye, unajua mimi wagani kimuonaga yeah. basi kwa moyo wangu mimi na fly. Istoshi yeah, yeah. waga kikuja. Umeona kwa mfano kazi kama hiyo ina maana ninge nilikuwa nategemea kwamba basi labda hadi kesho. Hadi kesho. Lakini kwa sababu umekuja sio siri umenitia moyo. Yeah, just thanks you. Yeah. Umenitia moyo. Yes. Nashukuru sana. Yes. Mungu abariki kazi ya mikono yako. Amen, amen. Tena sana. Na yes. kwa wale wote mnao support ndugu zangu, mabrada zangu, madada zangu. Yeah. Yaani nasema nashukuru sana. Yes. Asante. Nafikiri tutakuja tuonane kesho. Yeah, so yeye says uh, thank you so much to everyone who supports us. Says when I'm here at least I assist him. You know even for me guys, uh, I like involving myself maybe in uh, different activities i don't i just don't like maybe if i'm here you just sit and maybe tell people to do this do that whatever the simple jobs that i can do maybe like watering here maybe assisting him in pushing a wheelbarrow i always it's like also it's uh like uh, an exercise you see yeah you can do just things just to keep also your body fit so let's plant the other seeds and then now we we call it a day and wait now for uh, our uh, our kitchen garden to grow so thank you so much guys for watching the video till the end it's now towards the end of the day uh, we'll be also assisting matiko junior matiko junior yeah yeah we'll be assisting matiko junior to open up his youtube channel maybe tomorrow he can shoot uh, one video on his channel and uh, you guys will support him by also subscribing so thank you so much guys Kindly watch the video till the end. Don't skip the ads. Share the channel to maybe family and friends. Yeah, that's one big way of really supporting us. So goodbye, guys. I'll be seeing you in my next video. So Miss Flay is already here. They are uh, cooking for us. Before we end, <laughs> let me just show you. Kindly, guys, go watch her video. I was about to end, but then I remembered that we still have Miss Flay here. So they're really cooking something uh, delicious. Yeah, they are cooking something delicious here. Yes, Miss Vle, how are you? I'm fine. Yes. How are you guys? <laughs> Say something. Why am I blushing? Anyway. I don't know. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Maybe because I'm I'm in the right mood. I'm oh, in a good the, mood. A good we are mood. preparing something. Yeah. Guys, yeah. Anyway, guys. Um, Thank you, Nasta, for hosting me in your channel. Yes. My name is Miss Fle. I'm also a content creator, guys. Can you go and check me out? I have some amazing, amazing videos. Yeah, and one of them is is uh, is still cooking right now. You can <laughs> go. <laughs> I think that's what's keeping me excited. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, go and check that video out, guys. It's on my channel. Yeah, I will just, for the new members, for the new subscribers who maybe don't know me, I'm Miss Fle. In case you are mispronouncing the name, it is M I double S. Of course, you know the miss. So F L E, yes. not double E. F L E. Yeah. Subscribe to my channel. Support me and support my hubby. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> and we have Mr. Maja here. Yes. Yeah, Mr. Muslim man. <laughs> yes. Uh, no, I'm not Muslim, guys. Uh, my name is Maja underscore K E. Uh, welcome back to uh, It's Nasto, and uh, I'm really happy, uh, guys. Today, again, I'm here at uh, It's Nasto, and of course, It's Nasto residence, and uh, everything is so good. And we are waiting for the aroma. I don't know if you can smell that from the Yeah, there's inside. some good smell. Yeah, good oh, smell. Yeah, yeah, go check me out at Maja underscore KE. I'm all at all platforms. It's Maja underscore KE. They call me the village booger. Subscribe, share, watch the video till the end, and also support my brother here. It's Nasto Road to Success. We really appreciate what you've done to us. Peace, love, positive vibes all the way. And Eid Mubarak to you guys. Amen. <laughs> Ramadan Mubarak. Ramadan Mubarak. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Hello, Team Nasso. My name is Ben underscore Julius. I'm so grateful. You know, this is the first time I'll be taking Swahili dish. 
I've never, I've never even tested soil dish. So, pilau. Yeah, pilau. Yes, I've right. never tested pilau. <laughs> ah, for Papa is lying. lying. You have yeah. never tested pilau. I've ah, never tested pilau. Why should I lie? You are lying. Maybe he's right. You know, if yeah. someone knows. Uh, I, yeah. He has been attending a lot of weddings. Yeah. He has also been to somewhere where they have a lot of that kind of I know. When I attend a wedding, I normally take the brown ugali. And maybe beef. Uh, uh, That's my favorite. To, you have been to uh, where is it? Mombasa. Uh, not Mombasa. I've never Isli? been to Mombasa. Isli? Isli, I've never been to Isli. Uh, I've never don't even, lie. Don't <laughs> I've lie. never even so passed. Don't lie. Uh, passed uh, maybe he has camera. never tasted. Yeah, I've never tasted pilau by the uh, way. You never know. Yes. Yeah. Pilau. So this is the first time. <laughs> this is the first time, guys. Oh, I'm okay. tasting soili dish. Yes. So the very I first had, time. Yeah, yeah. The, I had this, this. <laughs> Those beans, there's a you, there's a that, how is it called? That. The beans that spicy. The yeah. So I'm really, I'm really <laughs> waiting for that. You know, yeah, yes. I've never tested it. So if guys, this is the first time seeing me in Nasu's channel. I'm also a content creator. I go by the name Ben underscore Julius. Kindly go support me there. I do a lot of videos about the farming project and about this village called Nyabohanse, the one and the most village. So kindly go support me guys. Thank you so much for hosting me Naso. All right. Yeah, so guys, Miss Flay is inside now preparing an amazing dish. Wow, wow, yeah, wow. Guys. Yeah, so I want to be showing you more of this. Kindly go, if you want to enjoy the video, go check it out on uh, Miss Flay's YouTube channel. Yeah. And uh, thank you so much guys. Kindly support all of us, subscribe, and we'll be seeing you guys in our next video. So. Bye-bye. Yeah.